myself, man. Without further ado, let's get to the video. Man, let's get straight to it. <laughs> nah. <laughs> hey, I knew it. I knew it, bro. I knew it, bro. But you gotta hit the hell one more time, bro. Bro, let's yeah. get straight to it. Oh my mama, we lit. What up, though? Big on TV. Y'all already know what time it is. We in the motherfucking trenches, but I just hopped in this motherfucker just to talk to y'all real quick anyway, because uh, I got the paperwork. I got the motherfucking NDA. It easy been sending out to everybody. Hold up, first off, it's Big Unk TV. Salute to Uncle Juan. Shout out to Stu Dog. Y'all niggas hit that motherfucking like, hit that comment, hit that motherfucking subscribe. All that good shit. We here. We with this shit, bro. I'm trying to tell y'all, nigga. I've been told y'all, niggas, I was tapped in. I got the motherfucking paperwork. You know what I'm saying? So. That's why y'all ain't even gonna see me, cause I'ma just post it. And I'ma just I'ma read it to y'all. So that's what we about to do. A little read along. Gutter City Entertainment type shit. <laughs> Please sign this agreement to confirm your understanding and acceptance of important conditions relating to services provided or to be provided by you or otherwise related to your affiliation or other relationship with Gutter City Entertainment and or any persons or entities included but not limited to Gutter City Entertainment and other affiliated uh, entities collectively, the company, owned and or acknowledged, I mean, oh, my bad, owned and or controlled in whole or in part by artists. Therefore, for good and valuable consideration received, it is hereby acknowledged and agreed as follows. So look, anytime we gonna see the word artist in here, you might as just replace that word with easy. You know what I'm saying? So that's what I'm gonna do. Anytime I see the word artist, I'ma just replace the word with easy. And just just to show y'all how this this nigga disaster wasn't lying, yo. First off, if y'all not even hip to why the fuck I'm even reading this motherfucking paperwork, uh, Easy and Disaster just had a battle this weekend, and Disaster just exposed that he was forced to sign the motherfucking NDA to get this damn battle. This is that NDA. You know what I'm saying? Man, you seen it here first, or maybe second, maybe third, you know, I don't know. But I look, we got the shit, and you know what I'm saying. We all can read along. So in the first chapter, where it say, and or controlled in whole or in part by artists, we just gonna say or controlled by easy. So anytime you see the word artist in this bitch, that shit should just say easy. All right, one, easy's privacy and is highly valued. And easy requires that all efforts be made to maintain confidential, I mean confidentiality with respect to all confidential information as defined below concerning easy's business, professional, and personal life. See, I saw the I saw the easy live. You feel me? Um with with Drizzy Jr. Shout out to Drizzy. And um, how easy tried to describe it was he just couldn't discuss information about cards or or money or how much he how much niggas is being paid. This say professional and personal life. Wait, I'm gonna keep it going. As hearing, I mean, as used herein, confidential information means any and all 
communications, documents, and other information pertaining to artists and or, oh, no, my bad, pertaining to Easy and or company, including, but not limited to, confidential information related to Easy's family and relatives, including, without limitation, Easy's spouse and children, or otherwise related to Easy and or Easy's company, <laughs> employees, agents, acquaintances, or business associates, including without limitations, information regarding a the personal life of Easy and or Easy's family and relatives, including without limitations. This word crazy shit. This word did one line. 2A. The personal life of artists. The personal life of Easy and or Easy's family and relatives, including without limitation, personal, matrimonial, and family relationships, health, medical records or conditions, habits, residencies, property, history, ideas, opinions, beliefs, or personal purchases. You can't even bring up the fact this nigga them, them bought his braces. You know what I'm saying? Like personal purchases. You can't you can't rap about the fact that the, what? Look at your bum ass shoes, nigga. I bought these, nigga. I can sue. Like mm -mm, I'm gonna keep it going. See, this is the part where it sounded like See, I guess Easy must have only read 2B before he uh you know what I'm saying? Before he did that Drizzy Jr. interview. Because this is the only part that he really talked about was part 2B. Like, niggas wasn't going to get, you know what I'm saying? Get a hold of the paperwork. You know what I'm saying? I told niggas I was tapped in, bro. Hit that sub. Fuck is y'all doing? 2B. Any business, legal, or financial affairs of company, easy and or Easy's family, including, without limitations, contracts, agreements, engagements, collaborations, investments, business relationships, Remy is his manager, um, sponsorships, endorsements, branding, marketing ideas, concepts, strategies, musical ideas, or works, television, you can't talk about this nigga being on TV. He can sue you. Um, literary or motion picture ideas. That's movie shit. Um, formats or outlines, trade secrets, fashion, designs, cosmetic choices, and or any information relating to Easy's artistic acting, hosting, fashion. God damn. Or musical performances, appearances without limitations to schedules, locations, travels, or security arrangements, and all negotiations, and other communications and documents related directly and or indirectly to any of the foregone. Fuck all the rest of that. So, god damn. Son. Like. So, basically, Disaster was saying, I could have went way harder on this nigga easy, but... I was forced to sign the NDA to even get the battle. Y'all niggas see it right here in the motherfucking print. Like, nigga, you technically can't get on stage and say shit about this nigga, dog. So, that, that right there, that just cleared disaster. You know what I'm saying? So, I don't know. Niggas gonna have to go rewatch that battle now with this information taken in. And, you know what I'm saying? Shit might look a little different according to, according to what we see right here. You can't mention this nigga family. You can't mention the nigga business opportunities, his business relationships. So, like, once again, Remy is a motherfucking manager, so... You can't say shit to, about Remy. Technically. if the, Like you said, if he did say 
in the uh in his interview, like I don't even be going that niggas like that, but you could. Like technically this nigga this nigga could probably fucking sue this nigga disaster just for like mentioning the bull Pat like <laughs> I don't know, man. Look, it's right here for y'all, plain in sight, though. You know what I'm saying? So, read it for yourself. Screenshot it if you need to. Just let niggas know that this where you seen it, motherfucker. You heard? Big Unc TV. Just salute Uncle Juan. Diz. That man won wine. It's right here in black and white for y'all. <laughs>